This is a dynamite show tonight. Here is a young lady who is a... I, I think it's safe for her to come out here tonight, although I'm not sure. She's making her first appearance on The Tonight Show, and she, uh, she created a sensation, nothing short of that, uh, in her movie debut called Ten. Uh, rather ravishing young lady. Would you welcome, please, Bo Derrick. Isn't that disgusting behavior? Yeah. Oh, did you hear that one guy yells out, I love you? Love he doesn't you. even know you. No. Nope. Yeah. How are you? Very well, thank you. Yeah. You are a pretty, pretty lady. Do you get tired of people talking about your looks and how stunning you are all the time? I mean, it can get to be, you know. <laughs> I mean, I don't. I don't. I mean, when people tell me. Uh, but, you know, people can overcompliment you all the time. Do, do you get tired or do you, do you like it? Well, it's nice. Yeah. I don't see that many people. Are you alone? Don't, don't you go out much? No. Why never. not? We just, we like to stay home and... Mm -hmm. Be private. <laughs> yeah, I can't say I blame John for that at all. <laughs> Have you always been private? Are you comfy? I mean, you. Yes, very thank you. Comfy you. There we go. Like a pillow? Or... <laughs> uh, marmoset or something? Marmoset. <laughs> yeah. I haven't. You know, I, I read the script at 10. Mm -hmm. I, I haven't seen the picture yet. I've only seen um, excerpts from it. And. Um... <laughs> <laughs> You know, I've, ta I've talked to thousands of people over the years, and I've, I've, all of a sudden I feel uncomfortable, and I don't know why. <laughs> Can I get in the chair with you? <laughs> you ever see? You ever see the show at all, Bo? This one. Yeah. Yes. Do you really? Always. Yeah. Have you seen it for a number of years? Or? <laughs> no. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And I enjoyed your special. With all the... Oh, the 17th many, anniversary 17th show? 17th anniversary. Yeah, that was fun, wasn't the it? The animals and everything. Yeah. I was asking you backstage. We just met briefly. Just a, just a passing in the night and saying hello. <laughs> Ships that pass in the night and we'll probably never really meet again. And, um... What did I start saying? Oh, I, And in the picture 10, you had your hair braided very mm -hmm. tightly. Mm -hmm. And I asked you how you did that, and you said it was very painful. It is the first few days. It's, it takes 10 hours with two people doing it, and you don't smile or make too many expressions the first few days. Right. Was, was it worth doing it? Is this your first picture? Mm -hmm. Well, no. I did a film when I was 17 with, with John, right. my husband, and he made it, and I was in it. And then... Um, What's the name of that? I don't understand. And Once Upon a Time. Yeah. It was in Greece, and it's still right now in the labs with the money man ran away, and, oh. but it's... Hasn't been released then? No. I understand that your, oh, your own husband, John Derrick, said he, he thought you were foolish to try out for 10. Did he well, say something? I've, I've read quotes. He says, some days you look ravishing and beautiful, and he said, other days you look like, and I was trying uh -huh. to think whether I should say the word. Uh -huh. What did he say? Was that he's, the... he's very critical, and, and, and if I don't look good one day, we don't have a very good day usually. He just, it, it really does affect. Really? Our, yes. But, and that's why, mainly because I eat too much that I have those terrible days. But you're so tiny. But I eat a lot. And, and no, but about 10, what happened with 10 was a girl called, John was always saying, you've got to get it in shape. You can't call yourself an actress. I mean, if you can't have the discipline to get off five pounds, right. how are you going to do this? So I was always eating and eating, and he kept saying, you must get in shape. And then 10 came along, and he said, well, that's good. Now somebody else will tell you you can go in, someone else will tell you you're not ready, and I won't be the bad one all the time. In other words, he didn't want to, he's your worst critic, huh? Yes. And so you I had a few your... days, and I lost a few pounds, and, and it, was, it was very fast. And you got the part. Mm -hmm. Now, you say you, you tend to, to get heavy. You can't weigh over 100 pounds. That's, 100 pounds is the heaviest I should be. But I get over 100 pounds. Yeah. Did you enjoy making 10? There, there's some, uh, there's some other nude scenes, and you're not, you're not. Nude. I was nude. What? I was nude. Yeah. No. There's nothing wrong with that. Does, that. does that come easy for you to do scenes like that? Um, Some people, not. I've talked with actresses before where they have a part to picture where they have to be nude, and they find it very uncomfortable. No, I, I don't find it uncomfortable, and, and 
the people around me didn't, they were very good and they didn't find it uncomfortable. I didn't have a closed set or anything. That's just, uh, it, it should be taken like you're doing any other scene. And it's, it's, it's a, a problem if, if you have to keep people out and yeah. cover up all the time. And it's, it's, not, it's not that important. Yeah. How would you, now the idea of 10, of course, is the perfect woman. And, and guys have always used that kind of you know, chauvinistic attitude and saying she's a six or six and a half or seven. Where, where would you put yourself? Uh, I don't, I don't. You don't? Uh, no. Mm -mm. Well, ten, ten, ten. I have a ten in the audience. You do, do, do girls do that, or women do that to men? I think so. I don't have a lot of girlfriends, um, and I didn't spend a lot of time in school growing up and everything with, with girlfriends. Really? A lot of them, no. But I think so. I think women are a lot cruder, too, I think. Really? About their judgments. I didn't from, from my experiences. What would Johnny be? <laughs> Be honest. All right, we had, we had an honest somebody from the audience said, what would Johnny be? Now you're putting her on the well, spot. I don't, because I don't I'm... know him yet, so we have to wait. <laughs> but uh, what would determine my rating? <laughs> I mean, uh, we, we, we have just met, as I said. Uh, what, what would you have to know about me to determine uh, whether I was, you know, a three or a seven and a half or possibly a ten? See, now I got it, I got it. Ten and a half. Well, no, we don't. Let me do this first. We'll come back and talk. We'll work this out, folks.